Hey guys, what's happening? Vitaly Dubin is here and I have such a privilege and pleasure to welcome Erwin Doctor, the CEO and founder of a revolutionary blockchain called Zenik. I'm so happy and so excited you're here. How are you doing? Thanks, I'm, I'm doing amazing. I'm really happy to be here and uh, yeah, I, I cannot wait to share some news with you guys. Absolutely. So, you know, I got very, very uh, excited about all the possibilities that Zenik is offering to the world right now and innovative, you know, because when I saw the, the next wave of crypto, which is the tokenization market and the World Economic Forum is predicting a $24 trillion market, we can tokenize real estate, art, intellectual property, all kinds of things, you know, NFTs exploding right now. And like, and, and you are doing something that nobody else has actually done before. And uh, the, the momentum is going so big. Your guys are growing so fast, you know, it's hard to keep up. So uh, I want to share with you guys, you know, what all this buzz is all about and how you can really take advantage of uh, this huge opportunity to, to this train that is moving so fast with uh, tokenization. And uh, what these guys are doing is, is really unique. So uh, I'd like to start with a little bit of background, you know, how this, this whole project, Zenik, was born uh, in your head, you know, how did you like envision it in the beginning? Like, hey, I'm, I wanna do something revolutionary. How did it start for you? <laughs> yeah, thanks for the nice intro. And uh, yeah, yeah, I mean, the, the, the whole idea started in, in 2018. And uh, um, it's, it's always in some projects, uh, you're having a nice glass of red wine and discussing <laughs> yeah, about the future, uh, what could be, you know, the, the, the next thing. And uh, yeah, and um, one of my best friends is coming from IT and since 2010 he's in, in blockchain. And um, at first, you didn't take crypto seriously, and him seriously. I mean, like. not crypto. It was, um, you know, if you have some friends, uh, they are friends. They are not business partners, and, yeah. and it's always a different approach when you're talking with them, and you're not taking them serious what they are doing. You're going out, having some fun. But uh, in 2016, uh, I got really interesting in the whole blockchain and crypto market. So I. I really ask him a little bit more in detail. Mm. So what is behind it? Is mm. it real? Uh, what is the idea? How the whole thing was born? And I, I was luckily the, the, the person that uh, I, I found somebody who had a real knowledge in this area. And this is, it, it was so hard in 2006 and there were millions of YouTubers. Everybody was an expert in crypto. I know, right? But nobody had the real clue <laughs> The real about knowledge, it. yeah. Yeah, yeah. And, uh, and, and, and so it was great for me to have really this experienced guy who was actually Actually in the space and yeah, then building, me. like, know the blockchain inside and out, right? A exactly, exactly. And, uh, and, and, and from this on, um, I was um, getting more and more involved and I realized actually what possibilities this technology is bringing for People us. People say once in crypto you learn about it, it's, it's safe forever. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, I mean, it, it was amazing when I realized what possibilities do we have. And uh, and uh, so in, in, in 2018, sitting uh, uh, with this uh, glass of red wine and he told me, look, I have an idea. Let's build a decentralized exchange. In a way that nobody did before. In a way that nobody doesn't and, and And this was the hook. This was the hook <laughs> when he said this sentence that I said, okay, wow, uh, what do we need? And, mm. uh, and I, I was coming actually from a totally different environment. And, uh, I so was, you knew you can bring the skill sets that you already have built, like organizing things. and Exactly. Exa and, uh, and, and, and to build up the, the, the team and, and, and the resources that we need to realize this project, this was my duty. Mm. And uh, I know that we were really strong in the development side and the blockchain side, but we needed to set up the team. You know, you need marketing, you need HR, you need so many different things that, uh, to, to set up a, a, a big company. Yep. And, and, and during this journey, I mean, we did a, a few really good things. Of course, we are humans, we are yep. perfect, but uh, we are learning. And, and uh, I think for the, for the future, there's a huge potential in all these areas. And, uh, and uh, when we started to develop this, uh, starting the idea from a decentralized action with a device, going then to 
a, a model how this will work, a business model, a collaboration with different distribution partners, and then in the end to say, okay, we are building a second layer uh, to set up the Scenic Smart Chain to do smart contracts, to enter the tokenization, to enter the NFT market. I mean, uh, just to do this step, this is revolutionary. I think in the beginning, 2018, you didn't think about all no, of no. those different possibilities. No, no. NFT marketplace. Not at, all. <laughs> not, not at all. I mean, you heard about it, but yeah. it was not in, in, in our target uh, area. But during the, the whole development, the move to Dubai, Dubai is like a, a, a crazy area where you see so many people, so many ideas, so many entrepreneurs, and it's growing so fast. And then you said, okay, look, uh, what possibilities do we have? All these digital art artists are living in Dubai, like the yeah. biggest ones. And, and then we said it's a, a non-brainer to enter this market and to start to work on these areas in the tokenization, in the NFT market. And this was actually one of the, the reasons why uh, uh, Said from the McToon family jumped in the program because he said, whoa, this sounds interesting. That's a real asset, which is, which is backed you know, by a token. And you said, okay, I want to be part of it. And mm -hmm. th this, is, this is the first time when you see you, know, you have a token and it's backed by a real asset uh, and it's regulated and accepted by the region. And, uh, and so I think you, this, you're this talking about push. here in Dubai, uh, uh, people that are, are part of the, the family here, the royal family, they got interested and essentially said, exactly. we want to be part of this. Yes. It's, it sounds very good, very cool. We want to support you guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> now, if you know uh, what is the focus of, of Dubai and the UAE, there is a clear goal that they want to enter in the blockchain market and they want to put, like, say, over 50% of all the companies on blockchain in the next mm. few years. I mean, yeah. it's a <laughs> very sophisticated goal, but uh, I mean, they're pushing really hard and they did like really top regulations already in Abu Dhabi and ADGM. They are focusing mm. now on, on, on Dubai in the DIFC and they're, they're pushing really hard. And I think they, they will have in the next few years like their blockchain hub uh, maybe in the world. Wow, wow. So Zenik has a unique blockchain, right? So there's coins and there are tokens. Coins have your own blockchain, like a Bitcoin, like Ethereum. So you build your own thing, yeah. which is super fast, right? Like 50,000 transactions per second. I mean, this is possible. Yeah, I mean, we... Up to. It, yeah, of course. But uh, I mean, if you know Visa and MasterCard, they're doing 20,000 transactions and right. you know how big they are. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. Uh, of course, the, the goal is to, 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 to have a, a product which will be usable also in the next few years. Uh, yeah. I mean, Bitcoin, <laughs> we know seven transactions per second. Ethereum is 27 per second. I mean, they are really struggling. And, and in, for the future, if you want to survive, you need these transactions. You need the speed. Yeah? And that's why, you know, it will be a game changer in the future. I mean, not now, but uh, it, it's becoming uh, a, a big topic now in the next few months, in the years. And uh, of course, if you are a digital artist and you are having a blockchain, which is very slow and costs a lot of money, I mean, you don't care if it's Ethereum or a Bitcoin or whatever, you will search for the best and fastest and safest mm -hmm. solution, and then you will go for it. Yeah? Right. Now, people today in crypto, they, they see so many different uh, blockchains and projects and everybody say we're fast, we're this. How do you see the unique blockchain and, and, and what you are doing as unique that nobody else is doing? Yeah, I think it started with the idea of the device because yeah. uh, our decentralized exchange is running on the device yeah? Yeah. and it's connecting peer-to-peer -peer with all the other Scenic hubs that we have on the market. and. Um, this gives you a, a, a lot of uh, freedom because you are not connected to, to a website or you are not uh, struggling because you have just one blockchain like Uniswap is just an Ethereum blockchain, PancakeSwap just on the Binance Smart Chain. Uh, you have uh, all tokens, all coins, all blockchain decentralized on a device. And on you a are device the owner. And you're the owner and have all the tokens you can store there. Exactly exchange all kinds of assets. Yeah, and I, I think this is already a, a, a big game changer. And in the future, uh, there is coming a lot of different tools with the Scenic Smart Chain. We will have a, a, a Scenic Swap, similar like Uniswap, also for all the tokens and the tokenization projects that we will have in the future. And 
I think that that we are building the, the ecosystem where you have everything included, you know, and uh, I think this is the, 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 the new and the big thing that we can reach, yeah? Yeah, I was in the event, obviously. We did a huge event here in, in <laughs> yeah. Dubai. Uh, I wish you guys were, were here. There was like uh, all kinds of uh, countries were there from around the world and uh, quite, quite some announcements you did. Yeah, uh, yeah. yeah. Uh, one, one is uh, with a huge private jet uh, company in the way building a huge ecosystem and they said you know what what we are building our, our token on the other platform we are going to move to the Nick smart chain yes. and that was exciting to see and yeah. this is just the beginning can, you, can you tell exactly. a little bit more about that that's yeah. exciting yeah it's a company it's called uh, Avinok Avinok and yeah. uh, they are on the Ethereum blockchain and uh, I mean it's an Austrian company it's a private and jet industry 13 billion dollar a year industry yes they want to tap into yeah yeah now that I mean that in general a lot of people uh, they don't know a lot about this private jet industry but uh, for example one one topic uh, 70% of all the private jets are flying empty. Mm. 70%, I mean, it's crazy. I imagine if you have the opportunity, if you miss your Emirates flight or yeah. Lufthansa flight or whatever, yeah. to say, okay, I go in the app, woo, there is a private jet who is flying also to Germany, Austria, whatever, and it costs nearly the same. Boom, booked, one click, pay with the tokens, tap in the private jet, and you're flying. Paying Done. crypto private jets. Exactly. And, and I think this is, this is really just one of the reasons why this company will succeed. And, uh, and we want to build actually for this company the highway so that they can really speed up on the highway. Like you're and supporting them, the, you know, the ecosystem, customers, uh, they'll be in your app, in the Zenic app. So. Of course, it's already. Already. <laughs> <laughs> now, it's a, now it's already integrated, of course. Staking. Yes, so yes. There are a lot of possibilities that we are working on, and, and Avinok is one of the companies who trusted uh, or uh, have trust in us. And uh, um, Then you have to, uh, Tupan, which is from yeah. Amazonas. Yes, um, Tupan is another uh, project that we are working, they are tokenizing the Amazonas, so totally <laughs> tokenizing the Amazonas. Crazy. Like uh, I read their white paper, it's like seven times the size of Singapore. They uh, have the place there. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Now, super crazy project. Uh, super experienced guy, uh, Mr. Uh, Ferrani Odeli and big uh, partnerships. Yes, yeah. and uh, I, I, this is just the beginning. These are two projects that we announced that are shifting to our uh, Cynix Smart Chain, mm. and there will be a lot of new projects who will also come to us. And uh, we are trying to provide, you know, the perfect and best ecosystem we can do, so that. Uh, in the future, hopefully, much, much more companies are coming. We're working on different partnerships, and uh, a lot of announcements will come soon. <laughs> yeah, that, that's great. So I know um, the numbers are crazy right now. We, we sold how, over 100,000 hubs right now. Mm -hmm. Is it milestone yeah, reached? Yeah, 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 it's crazy, <laughs> yeah. So We were having this conversation that, uh, you know, if you are one of those um, 500,000 first devices uh, if you actually bought one of which right now you have the opportunity to uh, we're still early on in the game so you're being lucky the lucky one in the yeah, next couple yeah, yeah. years yeah hopefully this will be uh, one one special thing ah, you were one of the guys who bought it, the, this this Scenic one hub and, uh, I did I did, yeah, I did. Yeah. and they're like you are the one. You are. You are the. <laughs> you are part of the lucky, lucky yeah. club. <laughs> no, no. We, we passed. Uh, um, I think a, f a few days ago, uh, over three hundred thousand people who believe in us so far, and uh, I think we're still growing. And I hope that uh, we will grow even more. And for me, that I was know, a couple of days ago. Yeah, three hundred thousand. Yes, yes. And uh, I, as, as, we, as we said before, I mean, we are still in the beginning uh, from what we can reach and I think 2022 will be a very important year for us where we really want to show the people uh, what we can deliver. What, what do you think will happen 2022? Like uh, give us an, a rough, rough idea, yeah. rough idea. <laughs> uh, rough idea, I think it's, it's for us it's um, the year where uh, we really want uh, to, to showcase what we are able to do 
um, not just uh, on, on one area, I think in, in different areas, starting from tokenization, NFT market, how we're developing different things, how the smart chain is working, how the exchange is working, how Cynic Swap is working. I mean, there are a lot of things that are really close to be launched or to be uh, started, and uh, that's why 2022 will be like uh, the year of truth for us <laughs> and uh, to show the world uh, that uh, what what we are able to do. Yeah, I know that you like have so much dedication to to this project. <laughs> you know, yeah, you, yeah. You, you you are like a fighter. You know, if you, if you take something like. You can scale it to the moon. You already proved to yourself. You know? <laughs> so yeah. I know everything you touch uh, turns to gold. Yeah. And uh, I'm so glad you're now working on your own thing and uh, like making it a beautiful, uh, big uh, masterpiece that is that is changing lives. Yeah. You know, it's already changed so many lives, and we are so early on in this in this game. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, I mean, uh, for me, especially in the event uh, that we had a few weeks ago. Uh, I was speaking with people from Nigeria, and uh, and they they it was crazy because uh, you know they were telling me ah this and this and you cannot imagine what you did already for the community and I, I mean you you hear this a lot of times but when you see a guy who is starting to cry and he's watching and you tell them uh, all okay and he said like you're saving lives in Nigeria and I like oh, come on you know? yeah, yeah. <laughs> and he said no it's no joke there are people who are buying the Sene cup and they are minting they are minting Sene coins and there is another guy in a market in a supermarket to have an app he's downloading the app and he's paying them with Sene coins to this guy and he's buying bread for his family oh really this he's, is no joke he's, he's buying pay, he's, he's paying uh, with Sene yes how? No, he's going there with the app and transferring them coins, you know, and he's from, buying from one to another, from one app to another app, yeah, mm. and 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 this is like crazy because he's buying like food, you know, for his family, <laughs> and and this was like for me like shocking somehow in the moment because, I mean, you're in a different world, and then he's saying like. People are minting the coins and then they go for shopping and are buying food for the family with this, yeah, and then you're rethinking everything and it's crazy actually and uh, I, I was surprised and uh, and you already have some partnership directly in Austria that uh, exactly people yeah. can actually take the the Zini coin go and shop, go shopping yeah yeah right? so uh, I mean it's it's uh, so far it's not activated but uh, everything is in place we got already the improvement and uh, it will be now in the next um, two three weeks latest end of November we will have the official activation. We will, of course, do a nice video from the first customer <laughs> who will buy something with a Thenic coin in the future. And we will have uh, a lot of different merchants who can accept uh, coins officially. And you can pay in Austria then with Thenic coins. Do, do you plan to expand beyond Austria? Uh, of in course, we are planning. Of course, we are planning. But uh, I mean, first, uh, you need a lot Implement. of regulations, mm -hmm. uh, license uh, of all this. Um, in, in different countries because it, each country is a little bit different uh, but we're looking for partners to develop this system in other countries also maybe in Dubai that we are talking already but uh, <laughs> but yeah we are, we are working on that and also the ATMs in Austria you can yeah. withdraw the Sene coins uh, against euros in Austria yeah go to ATM and put Sene coins there take euros from the ATM yes it's also possible end of November then, yeah? <laughs> oh, wow, wow, wow. Uh, what can you say about um, like real estate, like a building or something like that? Um, is something like that already in place or is this future we're talking about? Um, I mean, to tokenize uh, real estate, it's not something that's never done. So there, there are already companies who are doing it, so it's nothing new. Mm. Uh, but uh, there are still, let's say, um, it's still a process in different countries to get the right regulations. So there are a lot of countries that didn't even have a regulation to do this. Yeah? Mm. Also, if we are capable, if we have the right technology, if we have the right lawyers, if the country is not ready, you cannot do it. Mm. And uh, so you need to look for the right, uh, let's say, environment and the right uh, regulations and the right team to do it. Yeah? And then 
if you have this already done, uh, then you can start to tokenize different projects. Yeah, and then you can enter, for example, in real estate, where you said, okay, you have a building of 100 million euros, you do 100 million tokens, and then you have different models. You can do of one apartment, you can do an NFT of one apartment, or you can say one apartment have eight tokens, for example. If you have the eight tokens, you own one apartment. Mm. And then in total, the whole building is 100 tokens, for example. Tokens, yeah? okay. and, and so you can create different models. You have to do tokenomics. You have to do like a kind of business plan that it's working for because uh, the project itself needs to make sense because I can also tokenize a chair, but nobody will buy it. Yeah? Right. But so it, it has it, to be big enough. Big exactly. Enough. It, 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 first, it has to be big enough, but say, it, it needs to make sense. You know, if, if I'm tokenizing a chair, which is done by an artist who is like super creative and it's really something special, ah, then it's interesting because then there's a real value behind it. So yeah. you need to evaluate uh, like in, in real life if the project makes sense and if you can make money out of it or not. Do you plan to tokenize real estate? Of course, of course. Yep. We are planning to token on not just real estate, uh, art, but different. So really, you can tokenize actually everything. You know? and. Uh, and what we realized so during, like a like a marketplace yeah but what, what we realized during this this journey now the the last half year of of planning everything uh is that um there are too many people and too many companies who want to tokenize different things and that this is maybe not the way that we want to go so we changed a little bit the strategy and we're focusing now until end of the year to have at least five super strong partners we have millions of different clients to work with them and to tokenize with them or through them yeah and to, so that we can offer them the infrastructure the service the lawyer their regulations the whole package and they are actually educating a team that they are doing the tokenization and all on Zenic uh, blockchain of course yeah. Zenic blockchain <laughs> yeah. yeah yeah so i i, I uh, can imagine that each one of these tokenization project can increase the value of Zenik because it's more use case it's of course, more uh, of course building more value on the blockchain exactly yeah uh, but you know can we reach a point when we have uh, you know 100 200 tokens on the Zenik blockchain or maybe more is that a possibility uh, what, what do you mean with 200? like each tokenization project is its own uh, on this on the Zenik smart chain has yeah. its own token yes right yes so can we have like 200 of this in the future we can have 1 million of this uh, <laughs> there is no limit because each project is their own token yeah there can be real estate token one real estate token two real estate token three and uh i mean 20 we will have uh, most probably in the first months yeah not right. even we will have even more mm. uh, and uh, so there there is no limit and you can produce as many tokens it's as like you want. ethereum has all these tokens built on ethereum and it at the end of the day increased the value of ethereum because developers exactly. went okay uh i can go and build something on ethereum because they developed some standard that is easy to do yeah. so you plan to do the same like standard but for tokenization so people say okay i want to tokenize something where can i go okay i go to zenic they already have everything yeah yeah exactly so uh, the, the goal is um to build let's say uh, a similar infrastructure so that people can uh, say okay ah look i i have the infrastructure also on ethereum or in Zenik, but Zenik is faster and cheaper so uh, why are i going to to ethereum then and and so this is the goal but of course i mean ethereum have so many developers so many people who are working on this blockchain so i mean of course they have a, a certain advantage but we need at least to have a similar infrastructure so that people realize wow actually better work on this blockchain to develop here the things because they long term i mean it's always a matter of how fast and how cheap you are yeah i know i know and uh, it seems like you are the first to market in, into this type of uh, like standard standardizing the tokenization industry as a whole it's like Pioneers, in a, in a sense. Kind of. I mean, there, there are already companies, you know, who are doing that. But maybe not a specific blockchain who is focusing so detailed on this mm. and, and who can still adjust and do certain things, you know. And, uh, I mean, in, in the end, all the people who are jumping now on, 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 on tokens, on crypto, on blockchain, they are all pioneers. 
we are a small percentage of people who realize the potential and the opportunity that we have. And in five years, everybody will maybe use it. Yeah, but but now we are still a small percentage, and I think we are all pioneers still in this field. And uh, so I'm happy for everybody who is uh, asking and who is actually getting uh, the education to know more about it. So right now, the main product that uh, you have is this hub, is, is to yes. buy a hub, right? Yeah. That's the main thing. Yeah. And uh, and buying a hub right now, you can mint coins. You can mint the in coins yeah. for like 20 years. Yes, yes. So um, the blockchain started in, in February 2020. And uh, so it will have 20 years of... Uh, of production uh, that wow. you will have so until 2040 till 2040 it, was, it, it will produce coins yeah and then what <laughs> or is it too long no i mean and then what <laughs> and then i hopefully the the coin will have a certain amount of value and then for each uh, half coin or or less that you're producing you're very happy because this is more than the salary that you can work on right 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 yeah, uh, it's it's a long time frame, 20 years. But you can produce coins right now, mint them in the blockchain uh, every single day. And every time somebody buys a hub or a series of hubs, which you call a minting farm, mm -hmm. there is in place a team that is, the, the moment somebody buys, they plug in, they, it, it starts minting. Exactly, exactly. You don't have to wait until the hub is delivered. You're buying, as soon as you're buying, the activation is immediately starting. Yeah? And then uh, you're producing already coins so that you are not losing anything. Yeah? And uh, I think that... And it's that designed this way so every year. So it, it will produce like 50% less coins gradually. Yeah. And the more sales of the, of the hubs and the more time pass, it'll gradually it will produce a little less coins. So the sooner you buy the hub, the better it is. <laughs> exactly. You exactly. produce more coins. Yeah, yeah. So, so we have actually two halvings. The one is the time halving, as you explained. You know, it's approximately every year. Uh, actually, it's not the product. It's exactly yeah. every year, 50% less. But not on a date like Bitcoin, like the Bitcoin halving. It, it's actually every day a little bit less until next year at the same time where it's 50%. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. And, uh, and then you have the sales halving, which is directly connected to the sales. Yeah? Every 1,000 pieces, you are now producing 2% uh, uh, less on the coins. Yeah? Every 1,000 more, 2% less. Every 1,000 more, 2% less. Yeah? And uh, so this is going until 100,000, and then it's 1% less. And then other, again, 50,000, it's 150,000, and it's uh, half percent less. And so mm. it's, it's going every 50,000 is a, is a jump. Mm for every thousand, but every 50, and then every thousand it goes less in the yeah. percentages. But it cannot exceed more than 50% in a year uh, on the time halving that it decreases. So it's a mix, it's a mix yes. of both. So it's 50% and the sales halving included. Oh, so yeah. it, it can be more actually than 50%. Yes, yes, yes. Mm. Depending on, on the sales halving actually directly. So, yeah, it's, uh, it's not a good idea to sell right now. <laughs> We're in a very early stages, if, if, if so, uh, to buy, right? So it's, it's a very unique concept. And at the end of the day, you want a lot of users. You want millions and millions of users. Yeah, yeah. That's the goal. Yeah, I mean, in, in the end, the, the biggest value of, uh, of a project like this is the community. And, uh, and the, the stronger and bigger the community is, the, 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 the more you can do, you know. Yeah. And, uh, and uh, I think we, we started, I mean, a little bit more than one year ago, you know, to focus with the launch and everything. And I mean, 300,000 is already something, you know, it's it is, not, it not, is. Not, not nothing. Right. And of course, this is still the beginning, we yeah. know, and we have a long, long journey in front of us. But, uh, yeah, I mean, uh, if we reach one of the 5 million, the 10 million, or even more, these are already big numbers. And these numbers are helping us. I mean, you have thousands of, of different exchanges. Yeah, We are starting with a community of 300,000 people who will trade on our exchange. Yeah. yeah. I mean, show me, show me an exchange who starts with 300,000 uh, customers. It's not existing. Right, right. <laughs> it's right. not existing. You first build a community, then you launch the DEX. Uh, yeah. Good. So in, in, this is not existing. This and is one thing huge... we didn't tell you yet is that every 
coin holder of Zenik is actually participating in the distribution of profits of this uh, DEX that is coming. Yeah, 100%, 100 they, are, they are profiting on this. And this is a, so because it's decentralized, you know, we wanted to include really the whole community so that everybody is making profit out of it and, and, and sees the concept. And it's totally transparent because it's all on the blockchain. There is no cheating, yeah. no keeping, no freezing, yeah. all this. All the more coins you have, the more profits you're going to get. Exactly. From yeah. the, it's called the decentralized autonomous organization, the DAO. Yeah. Right. So it's distributed, it's like automatically in this decentralized way. Yes, kind of. Yeah. So, so um, a, a way how it's working a little bit, it's that, for example, when uh, you're doing a trade, you get uh, this fee that you have to pay right. for each trade when you're changing Bitcoin to Ethereum or whatever. And this fee is used to buy Sneak coins. Mm -hmm. yeah? It's not staying with the company, it's immediately buying Sneak coins and the Sneak coins afterwards directly are destroyed. That means that the total supply is getting less. And through the Sneak coin, the, 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 um, the, um, the value of the coin is going up. So it's, it's a very, very strong model which uh, mm. will help the community. So that's what you mean by distribution, like the, 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 the buying of the nick and burning it. Yes, exactly, exactly. Through which uh, the coin value. Exactly, drop. exactly. How it works exactly, I don't want to explain <laughs> because uh, there is, uh, yeah, it's, it's very technical and, uh, and uh, I mean, we still have a little bit of time. We will announce this uh, exchange in uh, Q1 latest and uh, the quarter two uh, in 2022. And, uh, but until then, um, you will have the, the whole white paper, how it works. But, uh, but this is already a teaser, so you can imagine in which direction the coin and the whole model can go. Mm, mm. That's very uh, unique. I have not seen such a model uh, that is existing right now. So it'll be interesting to see how it impl implements. And, uh, you know, you have, you're combining so many different things into one pro project <laughs> from, yeah. from decentralized exchange tokenization you know all of these things it, it's really something uh, unique <laughs> I would say yeah I mean uh, some people will say sophisticated <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I mean when, when you start to do such approaching and you have really amazing people behind you know w with a lot of experience you see that a lot of things sounds maybe so much different or so complicated, but sometimes, ah, if I do this and this, I can integrate this and this, and I have, again, this amount of tools. And, uh, and so a lot of things are connected. And, and I think you will see, especially in the year 2022, that everything what we are doing is somehow connected, and it's helping the whole environment to grow. And uh, I, I think on, 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 this, on this point, so that's why next year will be the year for us, uh, mm. where people will see, wow, this is connected with this, and ah, I can do this, and, uh, and a, a lot of, of dots will, will make sense then that maybe now the people don't understand, or, right. or also they don't know, right. but right. Uh, then next year it will be clear, yeah? <laughs> bit by bit, and yeah, uh, exactly. next year, because I know you're not going to stop just next year. <laughs> uh, no, 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 of course not. But um, let's say there, um, it's a so fast moving uh, in, environment, the whole crypto and blockchain market, that uh, I mean, of course, we are trying to do three year, five year plan, but uh, already one year is so packed with so much stuff, you know, that uh, also already 2022, it's crazy, you know, right. and I cannot even tell what we are still <laughs> working on. And uh, so, yeah. Some, some, some things we need to keep for a secret. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. people can anticipate. Yeah, yeah. But that's what I like, you know, um, a long-term project, you know, that people can be part of, be proud of, um, say I, I belong here I like it I, I love it I want to share about it and build something for a long term create a legacy you know people want to have a, a legacy for their kids they, they, they want to have something like uh, they say okay I missed the Bitcoin already mining Bitcoin is, is, is right now maybe too late for me it's so expensive but you can mint the new coins right now which is super early on and uh, it's uh, totally different, you know, we are, and, and, and decentralization here is built in um, with, with a thought because it's not like being minted at just one place, it's distributed, it's distributed in different locations around the world. So 
um, that, that's really crazy, you know. I'm, uh, I'm really happy that, uh, first of all, you are here, you're in Dubai, you know, uh, and, and, and you are just non-stop working on this, building this, bringing the right people, and all of this, I know it takes a lot of work, so thank you so much for that. That's incredible. And um, um, for all of you guys who are already part of this amazing community, uh, there is a lot to expect. There is a lot uh, that, that is coming, so that's exciting. And for those of you guys who are still not in, check it out, guys. You know, it's literally free to register. You can see inside, you can, you can watch some videos, you can, uh, um, you know, you can see how it, how it works on the inside and uh, see for yourself. It's working, it's, it's incredible and uh, you can take advantage of this opportunity for, to mint coins right now for yourself and um, to, to spread the message and help build a community and uh, you can be amazingly rewarded for that you know i i've i've seen some numbers and what some people have done it's it's incredible and uh you, you already some raised some bonuses <laughs> that was something that uh for the most ambitious of you guys uh, there is room for everyone to grow in in this community right of course of course <laughs> <laughs> so uh anything uh, last you want to say to everyone about uh Zenik? um I mean, uh, something that uh, it's maybe maybe important also that uh, although that uh, we are growing quite fast and we reached in, in let's say in the last year really a, a, a lot of things and we developed a lot of uh, ideas and things, we are still a startup. You don't have to forget because people are now comparing us directly with Ethereum or with Bitcoin. I mean, these guys are already a little bit longer in the market uh, yeah, and yeah. have already a bigger community. So, of, of course, this is the goal and we want to be compared with them, but uh, we, are, we are still starting. We are in our early stage and, uh, and so we are also humans. We are not perfect, but uh, one, one thing I want to mention, which is very important that... Uh, I will do everything to, to succeed in this project and uh, you know me now a little bit, I, know, uh, yeah. I was swim professional, yeah. so there is a, a, a kind of a focus that I was uh, really uh, pushed through my whole, whole I know, life. Right. When you have a goal, you have a focus, you're like, man, yeah. I, I'm, I'm going for it, I'm yeah, going yeah. for it. <laughs> no, and uh, I, I think we have a great team uh, and um, I'm really looking forward for the next few years. I know, I, it's challenging, but you know, you, you are, I don't know, it's like building this, this, this team, building the right people. You know, I've, I've met a lot of uh, you guys, people in the event, and all of them are incredible people on the team. Yeah, yeah. Committed, dedicated, and like full on board, so. Um, yeah, very excited, guys. If you if you want to learn how to participate, all the information, just reach out. There is going to be some info somewhere uh, around this video. So just check it out, register, and, and get started. Um, we are still early on in this game. So thank you so much, Erwin Doctor. Appreciate you so much. And uh, I'll see you guys. That was incredible.